afternoon, I'm Nick D for VIS on episode six of the Exiled Autocrafter. Uh, today we're going to be consolidating our hold over this, these little counties right here. You can see the chronological like progress. We'll, we'll go first this lady and down here, and we'll, we should try to consolidate this. However, uh, today might be the last day, of course, on Earth. He is 65. He is poor with frozen grief, meaning a moderate penalty. So uh we might we might lose the last autocrater today but thankfully imperial succession will have our daughter uh, Crevenio Priatios uh taking hold or maybe we might opt for someone younger like Eros Priatios so I might actually now I might disinherit her if we if we had prestige uh so we can't do that so we also need prestige to declare war so I think let's throw a feast we have the gold to do it. Uh, let's have a courtly feast in our capital, Nikesa. And uh, we are already there, so let's start the feast. Uh, servants, uh, lovely time ahead of us. Because we just got that extra bump, let's uh, declare war instantly. Fight. Uh, oh, we're in activity. We can't declare war. Uh, so, we'll just have a feast, cheery gathering, welcome friends. Uh, uh, this is more jovial than a good feast. Guests throw and fro, uh, to and fro, eating and chatting while flickering torchlight plays off every wall, light bouncing away laughter around the hall. We are a monthly band, it's true, but here and now I feel like a party could take on the world to win. Sometimes it's nice to simply uh, sit back and enjoy the little things in life. And uh, this is where I want to be. That will help, help us with stress. And uh, we got some prestige from our uh, wife's diplomatic skill. And uh, my Chancellor Chief Disnixia and my acquaintance uh, Lysicles spell the floor in front of everyone. To imagine they had such a secret. I like how we don't care, but fog approaches. One of your counties bordering the fog. Hold on. Hold, 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 hold on. Uh, counties are forever. Let's see. Where? Oh. So it might be this. It might be lost to the fog. Uh, please go on. Uh, we learned that she's a non believer. Very interesting ramble. And, uh, let's try to grow, um, uh, no, no, please don't go. I don't want to really be friends with that guy. But, with that, it's all done. And the art of merry making. And, but I have other pursuits. And so let's finish the feast. First, thing, first things first, we're going to disinherit our daughter. She's good, but it's just, she's too old. But her, yeah, even her, her children, that good, so. Uh, let's see, correct, you know, I mean, Eros. He's content, bossy, and cynical. Let's educate him. Let's make him our award. We can't educate him for some reason. I think we're all, we already are educating him. Uh, let's see relationship. He has a crush on this uh, on our on our incapable vassal right here. Uh, we could demand conversion, but we might actually might pass high tribal authority to to revoke instead of uh, disinheriting our daughter. But we could we could get the prestige from anyway. So I think ultimately, just have uh, like uh, an intelligent uh, and a young next lord. We will have Eros, who knows Conor Rufasani and Avisarian. We will have him be our next heir. Let's first see if we could choose a succession. Uh, it's Confederate partition, so actually we will lose a pretty good amount of. Uh, we have duplicate titles. Destroy title. So we can't destroy this one. Thankfully, it passes both to uh, Carvenia. However, uh, not anymore. It's when we're going to disinherit her. And uh, we'll get a... Yeah, she's going to hate us for it, but it's what we have to do. So our our lore, our, va our uh, heir now is going to be uh, Lore Ruler Alexados. That's good enough. He's actually a latent magi, but he is a flagellant. So our grandson will now inherit. And now let's, uh, let's go conquering. That's that's how we... Uh, uh, but harsh judgment, punishment do not fit the crime. We'll, we'll eat up these two little counties now while we have the prestige. There we go. 
Let's give this to, uh, let's give it to our grandson here. Gratios. Uh, let's get, uh, let's double, let's see if we can double up this war. We might actually have to devote more attention to this one, because they actually have a pretty good force. And, uh, hired a bunch of mercenaries. That's nice. I think we can hire some more. But we still outnumber them. And we're gonna take these guys out too next. Maybe we might even do a duchy conquest. Or, yeah, we could try to... You can see the Kingdom of Night, or Principality. They're not They're not a king. They are uh, in our path. That's cool. And we have a fog eater in our court now. I thought they said the, the fog was broaching. But the lure of language, uh, why bother? Abys Western adversary is clearly superior. So be it. Uh, now let's get our forces right here. We're going to win the battle, so their mercenaries didn't really help. Still, that was a good effort. Like, I'm glad, I'm glad they did it. But we're being raided. We're above our domain limit. Uh, Mixo pull. Uh, it's another another robber keep. So maybe we might want to give uh, this one away. We'll keep. We'll hold on to these robber keeps. And the more prestige we get, we can also probably enact our uh, tribal authority. So that'll be good. They really thought they could hire vast. Uh, I mean mercenaries. They really thought it didn't work. <laughs> We're being raided down here, though. Thankfully, it's not our capital. Mysteries of the Scripture. I'll be, uh... Let's make him content. We we, we only want content heirs. And, uh... A twist of fate. Today... Oh! Low ruler... Oh, our granddaughter is now our player heir. Yeah. No. Well, uh, we'll never know what kind of king he would have become. He was maimed. Uh, one tale ends, another begins. I don't know. First of all, I, I don't know why uh, it's not going. Who Who is the mother? Oh, Visaya. Visaya, Visaya. I think it passed to Visaya's children. And you can see the Lenda Piratios, player heir. Uh... Okay, we need 150 Dynasty Renown. We are uh, obscure to uh, disinherit. Oh, we won that. The Helium, uh, Noble Western Adversarian Culture. Uh, we'll see what more conquering we can do. Just consolidating our hold over this valley. We can conquer the Duchy. Oh, that's that's perfect. We're, gonna, we're just literally going, like, staking down this river. You can see just because there's weak lords right here, but available perk. Let's get, uh, part of the fam, maybe, uh, yeah, let's get Inspiring Rule just to get more prestige. Let's make sure council. Yeah, they all hate us. Let's assign, uh, Prince Di Diocleon. He is, uh, oh, look at this. We have a guy from, uh, from, uh, uh, the Black Sun's court. He, I think he, yeah, he, he, he died. Yeah, I thought he was a bit of fat, but no, he just died sickly. Not a fate for the Black Sun. Let's uh, detach procedures and go attack these guys right here. We should wipe them. And yeah, we literally wiped his entire force. There we go. Two new counties. Uh, Western Adversarian. Western Adversarian. So the Kingdom of Kamusa is branching out like this. Let's see. Ooh, alliances. They're, they're starting. They're, they're starting to ally each other again. Good. Uh, conquer Duchy. Ooh, we're short on prestige. We'll leave that up for our uh, daughter, but, uh, oh yeah, let's ransom them off. 
And there we go. King Koisa Kamusa's soul has finally been cast at Skotso at 67 years of age. He died of old age, and as old man, he lived a long, fulfilling life. Queen Delindio is on the throne, merely 11 years old. She will later rely on her regent Kosion during her first uh, years of rule. So we are now Queen Delendia of Kamosa. We are robust, uh, pensive, gluttonous, and just. We are also a uh, uh, confederate pa partition. Our, uh, we've lost a lot of vassals. But you can see Regency. Still, I, I don't know why we're getting all these tool tips. But no player heir. Uh, you have no playable titles and your dynasty members will pass on. We have a dangerous faction of independence based off uh, Shovoki vassals right here. But we thankfully we have a lot of gold in case they want to do that. They want to fool around. But we are overlord of uh, Kamosa. Um, yeah, I don't know how two titles were created. That That's weird. Probably a glitch. Let's open our inventory. Let's get mail. Uh, and uh, sphere. So uh, we are gonna try to make our focus. Oh my god, look, I forgot this. I forgot about I can choose my focus. So we'll make ourselves a march. We'll be a warrior queen and try to fight for a dynasty. Uh, you can see, pay ransom. I. How, how do we have uh, this guy captured? Uh, we'll take the gold. And, uh, yeah, we are one of the largest kingdoms on the map, so you can see we've expanded out this valley. Okay, I want them. I want them to try something. You can see Shavoki populace. Yeah, they're gonna they're gonna try something. We're not gonna like that. So we lost a little bit of our count. Yeah, we lost from our aunt. Provoke title. Yeah, we need high travel authority. So. Uh, first of all, we should try to win this war that's coming, and then once we win that war, uh, but this your uncle, vassal, and friend. I think I like you. Maybe we can marry him. Uh, okay, might as well. We'll marry, we'll marry our uh, cousin. Uh, we'll marry our uncle, actually. <laughs> so... Adversary and incest, we're keeping the blood pure for that. We we are the children of the first men. Uh, we are descended. But uh, you want freedom, you have in debt. Wow, there's a pretty hefty amount. Let's get some mercenaries. Let's even the in the score. Uh, back. Uh, look at that, perfect. All our vassals came to assist us. There we go. Shavokis. Gotta gotta learn their place. We could expand up north also here. Look at this. It's like anarchy. Kingdom shattered or something. You can see uh, more children of the Black Sun. That's cool. Uh, but I, I, I think we want to keep in our general like geographic area. Pay ransom. We could finish off our right here. Concord County. Yeah, let's do this. The more counties we take independently, the more like forces we can raise. Let's just seize your capital. This once, like our, oh, this duchy that was once like the bane of our existence has been uh, turned just a little like something we can like get rid of. But uh, we have a crush on our uncle who's also going to be our husband. But subsidize leech authority. Pass. I have uh, proposals. Yes, yes, now, now you're thinking. Now we can revoke title. Tyranny. We 
could goad them into rising up. I'd rather do something like this. Shivoki. Other disgruntled vassals. Okay, okay. I'll show you guys. I'll show you guys what we're about to do. You guys are going to witness. Let's wipe their army right here. But the beating. Uh... Stupid little kill crop, why must you always be in my way? I'm going to teach you a lesson. Cathar exclaims, reaching out for a nearby cudgel. What have I done wrong? I only want to see what Cathar was doing. Uh, but I must always be on guard. Let's be paranoid. I think that's part of a adversarian experience. Okay, okay. I want you guys to witness what I'm about to do. Watch this. Watch this magic right here. So we're going to revoke her title. She's gonna say no. So yeah. And uh, now she's gonna rise up with these other vassals. However, what we're gonna do is beat her right here. Siege her holding. And then we'll be able to imprison these two guys. We'll actually we'll automatically imprison them. And the AI, they don't know it's good. They'll just they'll just keep uh sieging stuff down here. This is this is how you do it. Did you guys have to play the game? Oh, okay, never mind. I think I was wrong. Uh, it's a little concerning. So now we gotta fight these. Uh, we could get another another uh, mercenary company, I think. Let's see. Uh... Okay, we're just gonna eke it out, I think. But, uh, uh Stegita Spare, Curse those Mega Stinny Dogs. Okay, thankfully they didn't, like, fully raid us, but let's go down here, catch your army again. Six months. I don't think they have any siege equipment. They're sieging a castle, but we're sieging a tribe. So, I what I, what I initially thought would happen is because... Though we're fighting a one cat like county thing, we would uh we would siege down their holding and automatically win the war once we take it. And then we'd be able to imprison and revoke these two like vassals right here. Let's let's beat him again down here. That should give us four score. My injured father, nothing can be done. Ninety-three. It's five uh Yeah, let's just crush him down here. Oh, that didn't, uh, that didn't end the war for some reason. Yeah, we're, we're crushing them. There we go, ticking war score. So, now time to reorganize. Let's see, uh, yep, let's, uh, revoke. And, of course, we're missing prestige to revoke it for some reason. Uh, pay ransom. Nope. No, no, no. We we almost they almost got they almost got me there. They almost got me. That was smart. They knew I was I wasn't like fully paying full attention. So uh we'll keep this duchy title. Uh, so we only need 268 prestige. Again, I don't know how like why we need prestige to revoke. Probably because we're tribal, though. So we're not going to let them pay ransom, of course. Why would we? Let's see. Here. We'll just try to create duchy holdings right here. Honey Reach. I like that. That's a cool, cool title name. There we go. Uh, uh, missing 41. Let's see. Uh, the lyrics. Let's find a content. Content Absolver. In the scene. There we go. We got a, a duchy. And the uh, uh, shadows have uh, the mercenary group helped win the war. They ran out, so can't use them anymore. Uh, oh, oh my god, we actually inherited. That's cool. Uh, from uh, who did we inherit it from? Chief uh, Nexia the Aggressor. She never had any children. That is very, very nice. Uh, pay ransom? No. 
we're gonna. I, they're just spamming. They they know. They're they're afraid. They know I'm about to revoke the shit. Like coming of age, Queen Belinda, you are a woman now. Uh, betrothed can marry. Our uh, oh yeah. So that works out. Our our child will inherit both this title and like the the overall royal title. So I think. Let's see. Uh, could get some more stewards and pull more land, but. We might get uh let's try to get Marshall. However, I think we'll we'll try not to ever fight. Let's see, uh there's a way to make us never lead armies, but uh, I don't know. But we'll we'll try to keep our house in order, but murder our Nexus. Let's also get our council up. Core Magi aside. Let's uh get him to help manage in domain. Perfect. Things are coming together. Also, from the wedding, we got prestige, so we can do this. Provoke. Ah, uh, let's kill her now. Oh, we need prestige. We're not going to waste prestige on that. We could just do this. Yeah, okay. Uh, I think try to rope this tile. So we now hold five out of five holdings. We are way stronger. This, uh, she's 19 years old. We've been abusing this character for like her whole life. So we, we've not given her any breaks. Uh, oh, look at that. One county down here. Let's just quick little war. Quick little war to end the episode. Watch it not be quick at all, but uh, Conquer County. Let's connect our lands. Uh, my injured court magi. Nine months and just besiege this. I think the Kamosa should be. Uh, oh yeah, we have. I don't know why we need a regent. Let's uh, to start. Oh yeah, he doesn't want to. He doesn't want to give up power. Let's swing the scales of power. Let's leverage gold. So we're gonna be battling with the regent, but we are pregnant. That is very good. Let's. I'm praying for a son, a very intelligent son. We'll name him Kois, of course, and he'll be our perfect heir. And we'll try not to get him to die in battle. That would be very unfortunate if he did. And uh, once once we win this, let's give it the holding to our husband. Oh. Oh, they have a second barony, maybe? Oh my god! Did I called it! I called it! I called it! I called it! Kois! Eh, he's hail, that's good enough. Kois Pretios, my beautiful, beautiful son, you will be raised as a warrior king. You will be, uh... Let's see, educate. Offer guardianship. We will raise our beautiful, beautiful boy. Oh my god, I literally called it. But a mind to mold. Excellent. There we go. Okay, my son, you will be, uh, you will be Lord of, uh, Pethelusnena. He is our cousin and our son. That is some adversary and incest right there. And look how beautiful the Kingdom of Kamosa looks. We are uh, making very good progress to taking over uh, former uh, Mikros Kalatipsi. Yeah, let's see. Uh, let's even have a Gila. Yeah, there we go. So we hold. Oh, actually, these areas right here are not in it. So that sucks. But we'll have to go as far as over here and as far as here. And uh, you completely control the region. So. Yeah, we're going to have to completely control it, but that'll be for next couple episodes. I'm Nick D4BIS. I'll see you guys next time.